Hey guys! Guys, we're here to do a band from Finland, one that we've never done on the channel before. And I always, every day I'm thinking, okay, we're gonna run out of bands from Finland. Yeah. And then every time I say that, I get like four different messages from people saying, hey, you haven't checked out this band and this band and this band and this band. Especially and my uncle is in this band and this band and this band. And I'm in this band and my cousin's in that band. Yes, and I also play in the other band over there. And I also play in a different band. Man, it's like you can't fart without a band being around. In Finland. Well, we can test that when we go there next year. I feel like while we're walking in the street, we'll meet at least five people that we know they're in bands. Probably. But today we're here to do a band that we've never done before. Like I said, the name of the band is Mokoma. The name of the song is Takataldi. Yeah. I think I pronounced that right. I'm, you're, I'm, 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 you're getting better. My, my finish is getting better. My finish is getting Every better. Yes. is getting worse. Yes. Naida. Soon, Naida. Soon, like in a couple of years, soon you won't be able to speak English and you'll just be able to speak Finnish. Wow, that would no, that will never happen. But if I can get my finish to the point where I can least say and I can sentence. least say a sentence, like I can least say, you know, uh, I know I know Kitos means thank you. Like I know a few words here and there, not enough to put a sentence together. But if I can get to the point where I can least like order a meal, you know, and say thank you to the to the waiter, I, I would be happy with that. If I can I don't know, like scrape a little bit. Like, is you that know? your goal for next year when we go to Finland? My, I have a plan to improve my finish without buying Rosetta Stone. I have a plan. I have a master plan that I've been architecting in my mind of how I can learn Finnish a lot quicker. So stay tuned because I'm planning on, on vlogging that shit. It's going to be epic. Mm -hmm. Lols. Lols will be had. Anyways. Anything we do is lols. Oh, but that is going to be lols because the plan that I have... It's one of those Dr. Evil kind of plans. So, yeah, a trillion dollars. Anyways, uh, Mokoma Takatalvi. Takatalvi. I hope I pronounced that right. Well, Anyways, uh, time. I'm sure we'll find out. I'm sure it's probably part of the chorus of the song. By the way, this is a live video and it looks like it was filmed in Japan. Yeah. I'm, I know it's probably sounding extremely racist that I just said that. But let's face it, Japanese people love Finnish metal. So where else would a Finnish band go play but Japan? I don't see them going to North Korea. You yeah. know what I mean? Kim Jong-un doesn't look like the kind of guy that listens to heavy metal. You know what I mean? Plus, would you want to go play there? If he's not happy with your performance, it probably gets you killed at the end of the show. You know what I mean? No. <laughs> he killed his own uncle. For, you know, what I, I, don't know what, I don't even know what his uncle did. Like, what the hell did the dude do? It's like, it's your uncle. Kill him. Kill him. Can you give me a good birthday gift? Yeah. Yeah, he used to be mean to me when I was a kid used to take away my candy. I don't think he talked with an Austrian accent, no. but anyways, uh, let's move on. Takataldi. Are you ready uh, for this? One thing, I'm 90% sure, 99% sure it's going to be in Finnish. I didn't think about that, but with a name like Takataldi, I'm almost 100% sure it will be in Finnish. Yeah. yeah. There is a slim chance, maybe like a 1% chance it's in Estonian. They're neighbors. Oh. Uh -huh. All right, you ready? You know I don't know. Your, your geography is horrible. <laughs> your geography is horrible. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, let's do this.
Ah, Tokyo! He said, Domo Arigato, Mr. Roboto, at the end of the song. And they give a shout out to Tokyo. For those of you that don't know, Tokyo's in Japan. I'm, I figured I might as well say that. No, because you, you know my geometry is terrible. Your geometry. <laughs> my geography. Same, same shit. That's how bad your geography is. <laughs> my geometry. Oh. Oh, both are bad, though. Oh, my God. And I was just going to make a joke about Godzilla, but now I don't even have to because that was just fucking <laughs> balls, man. I loved it. All right. So before you get started, I just want to say one thing. That dude looks like a slimmer version of Trevor from Black Dahlia Murder. Yeah. With the glasses, the beard, the hair. The thing he the doesn't hair. have is the heartburn tattoo over his belly button. Dude, uh, that to me... You were like, no, it's heartburn. I'm like, no, it's heartburn. Dude, uh, Phil and someone from Pantera has unscarred, which I can, I can see that. But heartburn? I mean, like, I know you have a big stomach, but like... Heartburn? Like, you know... Like, seriously, a heartburn? Like, I wouldn't, I, I mean. I want tattoos to get over your stomach. I, 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 I have a little bit of hair on my chest. Maybe a little bit is like an understatement. Yeah. So I, I thought as a joke, I was going to tattoo Chewbacca on my chest and then shave all the hair, but just let the hair around the Chewbacca stay. So it looked like a, a really, like a hairy Chewbacca. Yeah. I, I thought about that as like a joke, but I, I never actually had the balls uh, to do it. But. Trevor, like heartburn. heartburn. Anyways, we're not here to talk about Trevor or the Black Dahlia murder, but we're here to talk about Mokoma. No. I love that. I love that. So hyped. Now I have a uh, thing to add to my bucket list, and that's to go to a, a metal show in Japan. But it can't just be any metal show because any metal. I feel like any metal show it still will be. Really I think it'll still be hyped. Yeah, I, I think the but Japanese people. But it has to be a Finnish game. metal band. Because that just takes it up a notch. I, I think that would take it up a notch. By the way, these guys, I, I don't know, I, I love the song. Yeah. I, I love his voice. I love the song. The crowd was hyped. The song, talk about a song that never lets go. It's like, it's hyped to the max. This yeah. song is just hyped to the max. I absolutely loved it. But as I'm watching the video, first of all, the first thing I thought was Trevor from Black Dahlia Murder. Because there's a lot of resemblances. He's just a slimmer down finished version of, yeah. uh, of Trevor. But then I'm looking at the band, and, and, and even a little bit of the sound has a little bit of Lamb of God in it. You know, like the way they look. Yeah, the guy with the dreads. The dreads, you know, playing the bass, you know. But the way they look, their, their sound, there's a little bit of, of Lamb of God in there. You know, and not like, you know, like it's not a straight photocopy. But no. there's a little bit traces, if you will, you know. Traces. I was going to say something, and I, I'm glad I didn't. Uh, traces. There's a little bit of traces of Lamb of God in there. Don't you feel that way? Yeah. I, I felt about that. And even their hypeness on stage, the way we've seen Lamb of God live, they're freaking hyped on stage. These guys had a lot of that same hypeness on stage. So I, I, I saw a lot of, of, oh, of traces of Lamb of God. Looks, the mosh pit looked amazing. Dude, there was one part of the camera goes through the front part of the audience, and there's a dude there, and he looks like he's trying to sing the song because he notices that the camera's on him. But he obviously doesn't know the, the lyrics and he doesn't know how to speak Finnish. So he's kind of like, it's like he, he, he was like a deer in the headlights, right? And I'm think I'm watching that and I'm like, dude, I wonder if that's me when I go to a show and I and I try to sing the song and I don't know the lyrics and the, and the guy's singing the song and he's looking at me and he's like, oh, look at this fucking idiot. You know, he can't sing the song. Especially, know, especially you know, you don't get to go to the friend at the rock pile. And if you don't know a song and the guy pulls the mic towards your mouth oh yeah the rock pile is tough because not only you can pull the mic you can pull you on stage and you can sing along like yeah. you know like it's it's crazy but just say i don't know the lyrics and then yeah I'm not, I'm not very good with lyrics imagine in the middle of the song uh, i'm not very good with lyrics and then jumps. <laughs> it stops i'm not really good with lyrics jumps off stage and then it just can <laughs> yeah. but this song uh, we gotta look into more of this band um we really have to look into more of this band even if it's not live videos if it's not music videos just even the audio because this song really piqued my interest. We've yeah. done a lot of bands that sing in Finnish, but the hypeness around these guys, the style of their sound, and this song, like I said, it was almost like the Finnish version of, of Lamb of God. There was a little bit of Lamb of God in there. All of this put together, really makes me want to look into more of them. Like, they really, to me, these, this video to me opened the floodgates. Now I, I now 
I need to get my hands on more. Yeah. It's so badass. And, and I'm surprised that we've had the channel for, for a year, over a year now. And only recently, people have been mentioning this band. I don't think anybody mentioned this band like, you know, a year ago. I you mean, know, like when people start mentioning Stamina, for example, nobody mentioned these guys. And I'm surprised because, wow. I mean, there are still so many Finnish bands we have to go through. That's true, but... And, and I, I feel like a year from now, there's going to be that one band that, that nobody mentioned. Nobody mentioned, and we're just going to fall in love with that band. Yeah, it's a possibility. It's a possibility. This like one this year around, there was Winterson from Finland. And now I'm wondering. Winterson and then Nightwish. And Nightwish. As, as Winterson. Now I'm, I'm waiting for this year. What's going to be the band this year? Yeah. Wow. For me, I'm not going to say it's these guys, but these guys so far are, have really, really piqued my interest. Because Winter Sun, they sing in English. Nightwish, they sing in English. But these guys, they don't. But they have the hypeness, they have the sound. And I really like everything ar- about it. So for, I'm, for, I'm not saying we're going to do a video of these guys every single Sunday. But I want to look into more of these guys. Because it really piqued my interest. I really enjoyed this song. You know what? This is going to be my new Black Ninja. Tomorrow, I'm going to walk into the office. Pop my head into somebody's office. And then I walk up. Fired. My boss doesn't work in my office. She works somewhere else. But somebody could complain. But then again, they don't know what the hell am I saying. I don't even know what I'm saying, by the way. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> so, anyways, Nada. Nada. Is it Nada or Nada? Nada. 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 <sighs> Kitos. Kitos. That's all I got to say to the band for putting a song like this together. Anyways, guys, this is it for today. Come back tomorrow. We'll have more videos for you. See you guys. See ya.